As I think about Ray Hanley and him being a recipient of the Betty A. Lowe Award, I am struck by the fact that uh, Ray is a person who is dedicated to this state. He has traveled the state and has learned its history, and he is somebody who is certainly a true Arkansan to, to the core. I've loved the outdoors for, for many years. I was one of the founding members of the Sierra Club in Arkansas. My daughters grew up from toddlers backpacking in the, in the Ozarks and sleeping on the ground when it was cold and not thinking anything about it. I've collected uh, old Arkansas postcards for 30 years. I've uh, been able to author or co-author um, 15 Arkansas history books. There's no shortage of things that, that I have found to uh, occupy my time when I, I, I was not working. Ray's impact uh, on the, the state of Arkansas and the children of Arkansas has been a result of his role as the state Medicaid director and his role as the person who is most responsible for developing Medicaid policies in the state. In 1986, he became the Medicaid director in uh, Bill Clinton's administration and um, kept that job for 16 years. Things that come to mind that, that I'm, I'm really proud of in that tenure, obviously, was the creation of the Connect Care program, the medical home program. But, but if I think about the thing that perhaps I'm proudest of, it was working with people like Governor Huckabee, Amy Rossi, Senator Beebe then in the Senate to create the Our Kids First program. I know healthcare improved, certainly the healthcare infrastructure of the state benefited from this and, and it worked for everybody and I think we moved Arkansas way up in relationship to other states in, in what we were doing for the healthcare kids. The Betty A. Lowe Award was created to recognize those individuals that have done outstanding work in providing services and assistance and advocacy for children in our state. And Ray Hanley certainly personifies those values.